and head coach Voith now joining us here in the post game. And uh, Wade, congratulations. Uh, what a win tonight. Uh, did you anticipate or hope to get 3-0 tonight against Woodward Granger? Well, of course I hope for that. <laughs> Um, honest to God, I, I didn't anticipate anything. I just wanted, of course I wanted 3-0, but at this time of year, I don't care. If we played all five and came out with the W, I'd have been happy. What did you feel like your team needed to do uh, to come out and get the win? We wanted to be aggressive as always. We wanted to get off to a good start in the first game. We felt like them coming into our building, um, they're a little younger. You know, maybe the first time in this sort of an atmosphere or whatever, we thought we needed to get off to a good start, maybe rattle them early, and I felt like that's pretty much what we did in the first game. What did you want to do with Muser? They're, they're a good hitter on the outside. Well, we want to put up a good block with her. Um, she rolls it over the top of the block a little bit, so um, you know, I don't know how well we did blocking her, but I think um, in the back row we moved our hitters in into the middle where I think she liked to hit, and I think we did a pretty, pretty decent job digging her. It looked like part of their game plan at times was to attack Ashley Hankinius on the serve. That seemed to work out pretty well for you guys, though, tonight. Yeah, I I would love people to attack her because she's I think she's definitely one of our best passers. So, uh, you know, a lot of teams that do that, if it's your setter, they want her to pass it off and nobody else is going to set. But we're, we're totally okay with that. If you want to attack her, you know, that, that's good with us. Overall, how did you feel like the back row played tonight? Um, pretty, I, I thought our back row passed really well. Um, and they, they have some pretty decent servers, too, and I think we did a good job off their servers. Um, again, I would like to be a lot more aggressive on defense, you know, dig up a few more balls. I don't like it when we let them drop and they're put in, you know, without a whole lot of effort. But serve receive and general passing, I thought we did a pretty decent job. Serve for you guys pretty good tonight. I thought the game, first game, game and a half was really well. Serving? Yeah. Yes. Um, you know, I, I hate missed serves, but we kind of decided about halfway through the year that we're going to live with missed serves and we're going to aggressive. And, and I think that's been a good game plan for us because we've got a lot of aggressive servers. And, you know, I thought, you know, especially that first game, they struggled passing the ball, you know, which is going to play into us because we're going to shoot the ball from the back. So, you know, we just kept serving hard and eventually that's going to play out. Coach, did you ever feel like your club needed a, a little break or a timeout because they got out of any kind of a rhythm, or did you feel pretty comfortable without that tonight? Um, I, I was really close in the third game when um, I thought we were we were ahead pretty good and playing pretty well, and then they ran off uh, four or five points. I'm not sure. And I I was one point away from that timeout, but we, we got a good pass and filled it. So um, other than that, I kind of I kind of like them to work that out and maybe save that to the end of the game if they need it. So um, luckily that worked out for us today. So many hitters hit the ball well for you tonight. Very balanced attack. Uh, anybody really stand out for you uh, at the net? Um, I thought Tiffany Toms, especially the last two games. Um, the first two games, I, 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 there was something off with timing with her hitting. Um, but the last two, I thought she killed the ball exceptionally well. Um, both of our outsides, Hannah, did a really nice job outside. They don't always get the best set because we're playing off of a, you know, a defensive pass that might not be up in the front row. So we you know, set it out high to them. And I thought this would do a great job you know, keeping the ball in play for us. Coach, uh, Grundy Center, Wes Marshall, uh, what's the strengths of either team, if you know? They're both going to be good. Um, I have not seen much of West Marshall. I haven't had time to focus on them. I have seen a tape of, of Grundy Center, um, and I would say they play a lot like a lot like us. Maybe not quite as aggressive, but probably more defense. So um, with that match, I think it would be a really good match for us to play. Um, kind of offense versus defense, and West Marshall, I'm not real sure about that. I tell you what, we can't wait to see you over in uh, Webster City coming up on Wednesday night, Coach. Congratulations. Yeah, thanks a lot. Head coach Wade Voith again.